Mao Zedong. He was a communist leader of China. He was born in Shaoshan, Hunan, Qing Empire, on December 26, 1893. His father's name was Mao Yichang, and mother's name was Wen Q plus Mei, Xing Xiang. His father was one of the wealthiest farmers of the region, and mother was a farm worker. Young Zedong received his preliminary education at Shaoshan Primary School. At the age of 11, Zedong attempted to flee away from home to distance himself from Confucian upbringing, but in vain. His father soon brought him back. Two years henceforth, Zedong completed his primary education. Meanwhile, Zedong worked full-time in the field along with his father. Zedong moved to Changsha in 1911 to gain secondary education. Zedong served as private soldier in the rebel army. With an aim to become a teacher, Zedong enrolled himself at the teacher training college, the Fourth Normal School of Changsha. Zedong graduated from the same in June 1919 and then found job of a library assistant at the Beijing University. Later he left the job and moved to Changsha for join as a history teacher at the Xuye Primary School. The situation in China had worsened as Japanese had conquered large areas of China, which the Chinese Beiyang government accepted. With a means to protest the same, Zedong organized protests against the pro duan governor of Hunan province, Zhang Jinghui. He even co-founded the Hunanese Student Association and started a weekly radical magazine, Xiang River Review, in which he advocated the need for forming a big union of masses against the dominance. Zedong next organized a strike with fellow teachers and students but the group was threatened by Zhang and deported to Beijing as representatives of the China's provincial centers. In 1921, Zedong became an inaugural member of the Communist Party of China. Zedong opened a branch at Changsha. In the first KMT Congress, Mao was elected an alternate member of the KMT Central Executive Committee. Zedong successfully helped establish the Soviet Republic of China in the mountainous area of Jiangxi and was elected chairman of the small republic. He developed a small but strong army of guerrilla fighters and directed the torture and execution of any dissidents who defied party law. Though the communist leaders wanted to fight against the government forces, Zedong advised them to retreat. With the Japanese invasion in 1937, Chiang sought the help for communists as he lost control of the major cities and coastal regions of China. Zedong capitalized the opportunity to serve as the military leader and fought against the Japanese forces. The Japanese were defeated in 1945. Though America suggested for a coalition government, Zedong sought complete control and went into a civil war, which ended only in 1949 with the emergence of People's Republic of China. In 1961, with the failure of the program Great Leap, Zedong moved to the side to give way to his rivals to take the controls of the country. Year 1966 marked Zedong's return to power. The Cultural Revolution, formerly the Great Proletarian Cultural Revolution, was a socio-political movement in China from 1966 until 1976, launched by Mao Zedong. It is believed that millions of people died during Cultural Revolution. It was in 1969 that Zedong ordered the end of Cultural Revolution. However, the revolution actually ended after the death of Zedong. Mao Zedong married four times in his life, first at the age of 13 to Luo Yixiu. 
A staunch adversary of arranged marriage, he refused to recognize her as his wife He then married Yang Kaihui, who bore him three children After the death of Yang Kaihui, Zedong tied the knot with He Zizhen, who bore him six children when she died, Zedong went into the wedlock with Jiang King till his death. She bore him a daughter. He died on September 9, 1976, at the age of 82. Political power grows out of the barrel of a gun. Said Mao Zedong.